Welcome to Maker.io, The Gentleman Shorts, and in this episode we will learn what MicroPython is and why it's so important. The Python computer language has become so popular with coders all around the world that it's now in the top five most popular programming languages. The reason for its popularity is not any one feature about it, but the many features of the language as a whole. Python, unlike many other languages, is an interpreted language, which does mean that it has some performance issues, but it's also highly platform independent since only the interpreter needs to be compiled. So a Python program written on a Mac OS will most likely be able to run on other operating systems that include Python interpreters. Of course, there are some OS specific instructions, but they are far and few between. Programs written in Python have the benefit of being quicker and easier to write, unlike other languages such as C and C++. So just try to imagine being able to use Python on a microcontroller instead of something like C and C++. The time taken to get a project working could be drastically shortened. Advanced features would be easy to implement. And since the language is interpreted, you could easily offload applications onto memory outside the chip itself, such as an external SD card. Well, thanks to MicroPython, we no longer have to imagine. MicroPython is a lean and efficient implementation of Python 3 that can run on microcontrollers. Of course, these microcontrollers do need to be more powerful than your average PIC or AVR, needing at least 256 kilobytes of ROM and 16 kilobytes of RAM. However, the magic of Python is not in just the language or its ability to run on microcontrollers, but the fact that a special version has been designed to work on a very popular device, the ESP8266. If you know what this device is, then you should already be getting excited, and I will get straight to the point. Yes, MicroPython works perfectly with the ESP266 Wi-Fi system, and you can create sockets, perform HTTP requests, and much more. This merging of Python and the ESP8266 has just potentially taken IoT projects to a new level. MicroPython has an incredible amount of potential making microcontroller projects easier than ever before. Just like the Arduino, there is no need for a specialized programmer, the language is interpreted so that the system is unlikely to stall, and the projects that would be otherwise take a long time to code can be done in about half the time. So that's all we have time for today on MicroPython. Thank you for watching and see you next time.